Conor McGregor in the news again. Apparently, he was hanging out with the DJ in Italy, and un- allegedly, according to the DJ, which we've only heard one side of the story, but uh, Conor McGregor punched him in the face, threw a beating on him, I guess. Since he's had that surgery after the uh, Poirier fight, I almost wonder, and, and again, I don't want to make accusations, but I almost wonder if he's been on the pain meds because he's acting out of character like a wild person, like irrational, crazy talk. There's videos of him driving. It looks like he's drunk, again, allegedly. But it's out of character for him to be acting like such a jerk. Like he seems to be embracing this new villain character, and I, I don't get it. He's he's obviously got all the money, so he's not worried about endorsement deals at this point. He's made a lot of money, he made hundreds of millions with the whiskey deal. But man, it's watching him implode and and self destruct his image like this is sad to see. It's hard to watch, and I'm not a big Connor fan per se. But geez, he's really acting a fool out there right now. Beating up civilians is not a good look for an MMA fighter. Hey, listen, either these, another part or another element of it is, and I, you know, you got to sometimes take the light side, at least for a minute, then I'll get into the serious side, but um, these DJs must have good chins. Either that or Connor, <laughs> either that or Connor's just off, you know what I mean? He, he's got the yeah. bucket and, <laughs> and, you know, he's not in shape yet. But, um, but look, a, accused of all this stuff, right, um, and, he, and it happens on the day that his son, you know, pretty pretty serious day or important day or uh, a great day for a family. You're, you're blessed enough to have a healthy child and you're having your child baptized. And he was having a child baptized out of, at the Vatican. First of all, I, I got to say one thing, not that I'm correcting you, but he, not that it's, you said he's, it's out of character for McGregor. Unfortunately, the, some of these things have happened uh, in his past. Yeah, that's they, fair. They, they, they have. Let's not forget what he did with Habib with the whole truck when he picked up the... Uh, oh, uh, that's a good point. You know what I mean? Let's not forget. <laughs> I, that was pretty, that was pretty Danny, dangerous. I just, I that was pretty f- dangerous. He tr- picked up a hand cart, uh, a hand truck, <laughs> whatever you call hand that, truck. hand truck, and, and threw it into a bus which put... And a few guys <laughs> had to get stitched up. Um, knocked out of the... They got knocked off the car. You're right. I just feel... I, I want to find something good to say about no, the no, guy, but listen, you're right. I, but, He's but done this say, repeatedly. Listen, we know that McGregor has that bad boy reputation that he plays off it, and he make, it makes a lot of money for him. Of course, he'll, you know, along with his ability, uh, great ability that, that he's done what he's done. And he's in a tough place now. You know, career-wise, he's lost two fights in a row uh, to Dustin Poirier, our friend, and you know he suffered obviously a terrible injury where he, in his last fight when he broke his ankle. Um, if it's a, if it is his intention to keep up the bad boy, you know, stuff while he's recovering, so people don't forget him. You know, obviously he's he's doing that, um, and I know I know he's still rehabbing the leg and you know, has to come back gradually. Um, but uh, again, on the light side, um, even coming back gradually, DJs, you know, uh, you know, you know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> well, the DJ is better than the, the No, D- but even at this level, he could probably step it up a level. But look, even with the recovering leg, but in all seriousness, this behavior is starting to be something to be concerned about. And um, even dangerous, uh, you know, to him. And obviously, we just touched on it to others. Somebody could get hurt. Uh, I don't want to see anyone struggling in these sort of ways, uh, that he's struggling. Whatever it is that's behind it, uh, you, you get concerned when you see it. Uh, especially when you see a guy who works so damn hard to come out of the... I mean, he came out of the ghettos of Ireland uh, to make himself yep. a champion. And, and we've seen other people come out of terrible places, but we're talking about him right now. And he's a star. You know, you hate... The biggest. Uh, the I, biggest. I, I mean, now, now you'd hate to see him fall to this. I, 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 seriously, I hope and pray he can have someone around him. This is when you need people around you. Uh, you know, people... They they poo poo that. Oh well, you. I know you're you're a grown man. You're responsible for yourself. I get it. But these guys, he never dreamed he'd have this. Maybe he did. But chances are, he never dreamed he'd have quite this kind of money. And it's so important because it's hard to be prepared for this kind of you know this kind of 
what 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 comes with it i I really hope and pray you can have someone around them to help them advise them you know in the right truthful way not just guys hanging around making money you know because aside from the danger to himself and other people in those ways at this rate aside from as i already said with the you know with all the other stuff that's that's so serious he'll wind up broke when he settles all these lawsuits i you know nobody i mean is touching on that right now because he's made so much damn money you know um but my god uh, those lawsuits they add up they add up but but the most important thing again in all seriousness is a little message out there he doesn't need it from me but i'm gonna send it anyway um you know you've been great you've done great things You've been a pioneer in the sport in many ways, bringing purses to the UFC that were never seen before. You paved the way for that, uh, much like Muhammad Ali did for for so many fighters uh, in boxing. Uh, you know, uh, please uh, talk to somebody. You know, talk to somebody, and um, that's all. And and don't be too proud to do that. Talk to somebody, and don't let. Don't let yourself continue down this road, really. For your sake, for other people's sake, um, you've, you've been great in so many ways. You know, that's, that's not destroyed at all.